Rise and shine, everyone. It's Motor World Card Time. And today, I've got a big box of photos from PSA. And let's see what they are because they didn't even list them on the website. So I have no clue what I'm getting back. But obviously, some have been authenticated because it's kind of heavy. And I only sent, I think, like seven or eight. I don't even remember the submission. It's been like two months since I got it. Let's check them out on today's show. Hello everyone, this is Merlin of Motor World Cards and today, like I said, I've got a PSA authentication photo submission to reveal. Make sure to go to my channel at Motor World Cards. Please subscribe, hit the like button, and smash that bell button if you want to see more Motor World Cards. And today, I have some photos. Here they are. Let's open them up. I haven't even opened them up yet. I've been waiting for the last few days. Let's see what they are. Woo! From PSA. It takes like a month or two and I had a little communication trouble with PSA and they're probably being overwhelmed right now because the last two submissions, I didn't even get um, tracking for them. I had to like ask and then this order, I didn't even know it was coming. They haven't even listed it on the PSA account site. So I have no clue. I think I know what these are, but I have no clue what they got authenticated. But obviously it's kind of heavy. So several had to get authenticated. Oh, and I'm I'm here today with my dog, Maverick. He's a say hello, Maverick. He's a Bernie Doodle. He's almost two years old. His birthday will be January 1st. But he likes to um, watch me do these unpackings. You might see him more and more because he is a camera hog. Aren't you, Maverick? Huh? Are you? Okay. So he seems so excited about opening this up. Well, the first thing I have, lots and lots and lots. And lots, and lots, and lots, and lots, and lots, and lots. Oh my gosh, it's almost like an Amazon bo box. Lots of, uh-oh, lots of paper for the padding. Okay, I know what these are. These are rejected photos that I'm gonna save for another video. I'm gonna put this on a video that's about oversized photos and rejected photos. So make sure, like I said, smash the belt button. Oh my God, it's more paper. And more paper. Well, I thought that was too, oh, you know what? Oh uh, yeah, you know, here's another one that's been rejected. That was one, that's a bigger one that was rejected. So I uh, think I know which one that is. And this one has been rejected. So I have two photos in the submission that got rejected. So they don't just authenticate everything. You just can't go over there and Xerox an original photo and then have it come back in original photo. Like they know better than that. So yes, there is science. You have to know the art of photography. So here is, oh my goodness, here we are. We're here already. Woo! So they... They put bubble wrap on them that fits exactly the slab. So like it has like a tongue on here. So they're easy to rip off. This is the first one. Can't wait to show you all. I'm going to put that over here so I have a little space. Urgh. Urgh, there we go. Oh, I don't want y'all to see it yet. <laughs> so lots of bubble wrap. I'll throw it back into the box. Because I don't want Maverick to eat bubble wrap because it's not good for a dog, is it, buddy? Okay, let me see what this one is, because I have no clue. Okay, because like I said, this is my first time, so. Um, wow, okay, I thought this was a type one, because I thought I'd seen one like this from MGM, with the same type of print on the bottom, and the same kind of card, and the, board, the borders looked like it would be a type one, but they fooled me. Um, and then you see the, the stamped DNA on the back. Remember I said that about NASA photos, the, the purple stamp? So I really thought this was a type one because of that purple stamp. It's not the black um, published lettering. 
Anyway, this is Elvis Presley, and it came back a Type 3 authentic photo from 1970 from Metro Goldwyn Meyer, MGM, as we know it. And this is a publicity still photograph. You probably see it back here on Elvis. Talks about Elvis getting a gift. And then here he is. Here is Elvis in his one of his earlier Vegas outfits before he became Disco Elvis or Kung Fu Elvis, but still a Kung Fu outfit with his butler and a bike to give to kids for Christmas. Pretty nice. What do you think, Maverick? Do you like it? Okay. Next one. Woohoo! Next one. Oh, you want to see it? I don't want you to see it. Oh, I, can, I see what it is, but I don't know what it is. Please, 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 Santa, give me an early Christmas present. I want it. I know what the subject is. I just want to type one out of it. I know it probably is because I've had bought from this photographer and from the same source and their stuff, except for like two or three photos. One I sold to someone because they said it was shot at the same time. It was a run DMC. And, and I feel bad for my buddy because it came back at type four. And I was really mad because they said it was type one. That's the only mistake that this person I bought from has made. And yes. Okay, good. So if you see on here, I know you've seen some of my music photos. Are you leaving Maverick? Or are you going to? Oh, you don't want to help me anymore. Okay. So you see the photographer stamp and the subject matter or the, um, the information of what's going on in this photo. This is a type one from 1984 by Steve. The photographer is Steve Granitz, celebrity photo. This celebrity is at the Walk of Fame. It's original photograph. And it's of Michael Jackson. Michael Burt. And if you look right here, I think that's Emmanuel Lewis Webster right there. Cause you know, he hung around, he always, you know, was on Michael's shoulders. And there's Michael in his general, you know, sequenced outfit, getting his Walk of Fame star on the Walk of Fame. I have passed that star many, 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 many times. That's pretty awesome. That's a nice, cool photo. God, he doesn't even look real. He looks like the, the Wax Museum, Michael Jackson. It's kind of cool, but that's real Michael. I saw Michael one time walking down Melrose. That's like 20 some years ago. Ooh. Okay. I just wanted to see who it was. I'm trying to recollect what I submitted. This is crazy because I really don't know. But I see who the subject is, so I wanted to hide it from you all. So that's, I see it through the bubble wrap. And this, I know I have two of this person. Okay. Oh, well, I figured it's still pretty cool because it's um, still that, that date because it came back in type three. It says circa 1980. So like it had to be like 1980 because this person died in the early eighties. Musician who's in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. He's an icon. They're making a movie about him, and I think it's coming out in the spring. It was supposed to come out in October because of the strike. They started pushing some movies um, further along back, like Dune and this movie. I think it's coming out in March or April. I've listened to his CD or music many times. You know, they play a movie. I mean, um, weddings. They play it all his music everywhere. I mean, if you don't know one of this guy's songs, I, there's you're living under a rock, basically. You don't know. And it meant he's up there with my own. Michael is the king of pop, but this guy is the king of reggae. Bob Marley, poet and a prophet. Bob Marley told me how to outfit. I love it. This is a type three. So at least this was made within two years of this photo being made. So that means Bob Marley was alive when this was, photo was taken and developed. So you see it right there? Type Three, and this is not a publicity still like the Elvis one was. This is just a regular photograph taken from a duplicate negative. Got it? But cool, I meant. And it says photo by Alexi somebody proof, but I thought it was gonna be a proof, but no, it wasn't. See, the Elvis one was a type three publicity still photograph to promote whatever he was doing. 
Okay. Oh, I see. Ooh, okay. One more here. Oh. Oh, no. Let's see what else I have here. Oh, okay. This is cool. Oh, I think this is a type three photo. I'm not sure. Oh. I sent it in because a lot of my TV stuff and movies have come back type ones. I've been getting really lucky. And this is um, one of my favorite shows when I was a kid. I watched it all the time back in the late 70s, early 80s. You know, you probably all know who these characters are. If you don't know who these characters are, again, even kids today, you're living under a rock. And let's see here, because there's all this DNA on here. That's why I sent it in. All this DNA. Look at it. Look at all that DNA. All the DNA right there. Look. Oh. And this is a landscape photo. That means it goes horizontal, not vertical. Vertical will be called a portrait photo. Yes. Okay. Type 1. It did come back in 1979. Why would I be watching that kids would like, even adults, in 1979? I came on TV a lot. Um, and they're still known today. You, I think you see them at Disneyland. I'm not sure. Um, this is cool. Type 1, 1979. Original photo. Okay, I just have to show you. Because I give you any of this other stuff that's on the label, it will give it away. But here they are. It's the Muppet Show with Miss Piggy and Kermit the Frog. Yes. Oh my goodness. Type one. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Jim Henson Productions. It says the Muppet, Sh the Muppet Show, Kermit Frog, and Miss Piggy. Oh my goodness. Is that freaking killer or what? Ah. That's awesome. I love it. What do you think, Maverick? Do you like the Muppets? Okay, he passed out. He's bored. Okay, next one. That's not, I got two more. I got two. I think I have two more. Okay, two more. I knew I didn't have that many, especially with two rejected. So this is a short video. I hope you're learning something. But I'm getting better at this, folks. Let you know that I started terrible. I was getting lots of twos, threes, and fours when I started doing this six months ago. And now I'm getting down to the nitty gritty. I'm getting better. I'm figuring out type ones and threes better and better. The only thing was that I was wrong with that Elvis one. I thought it was a type one. It came back type three. But everything else so far has come back type one. Okay, so I know this subject matter. Okay, let's see what this one is. Okay, this is another Bob Marley. It's probably a type three. I don't know, but it says 1905. Oh, let me show you. It says 1975 Jim Anderson. I saw this on eBay and I was like, man, I've got to get it. It says Jim, like, I have to take a gamble. I spent a few hundred dollars on this, believe it or not, raw. But man, you can't find like people like Bob Marley and other icons in a type one photo. Even if it's type three, I feel like I win because a lot of people like it when it's the same era, that vintage era. And I think Marley died of cancer of like in 83, I believe. I'm not sure. And let me see here. Oh, man. Wow. Okay. Woo. Okay, I do, folks. The only reason I'm being quiet is my girlfriend's in bed right now, but... I'm really excited and I'm containing myself right now. Um, Jim Anderson is the photographer. This is from 1975. And this is a type one. Oh my gosh. Type one, Bob freaking Marley. Bob freaking Marley. Look at this photo. I, you know what? I know where this photo was taken because I've been salivating over this. 1975, Jim Anderson took this when Bob Marley was performing at Central Park in New York City, in the park, live. Oh my gosh, and this is an iconic photo, folks. Oh my God, oh my God.
I'm keeping this until the movie comes out. I'm keeping this till the movie comes out. I'm keeping this till the movie. I'm just going to show this off to people. I'm going to just show it off. Oh, could you be loved? Yes, I can be loved. Oh, don't worry about a thing. Because every little thing is going to be all right. You know what I mean? It's going to be. A, this lets me know. If Bob, you're looking out for me, buddy. I said you don't worry, man. And I am loved, buddy. I am loved by all these people watching this. The, well, the 10 people watching this video right now. Y'all love me. Y'all really, 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 really love me. Thank you so much. This is my last one. Ugh, this bubble wrap smells. Okay. I took a chance with this one too, but I'll tell you why. Um, I don't think it's a type one either because I saw like, well, I saw like the stamp or the company like the, what's it say? Like Kodak. I can't tell what it says. Agfa, I don't know, but you see like the company's logo on the back, but my eyes can't see because of the lighting and there's no DNA on it, but Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay, guys. The reason I did this, because this one had a red stamp. I bought this one not in that great of a shape, but this is such another iconic photo. And all the red stamped photos of these, regardless if there's any DNA stamps or anything on the back, the red stamps have all come back. Type ones. So I took a gamble because this one really needed a slab to make it look prettier. Because it was a little roughed up. And let me tell you, I've hit two, the, these are the two best photos by far in this video. And this is a type one original photograph, 1965, first US EVA Spacewalk, Gemini 4, Ed White, NASA. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. Look, oh my, would you check this out? Check this out, folks. Oh my gosh. That's the first ever spacewalk known to mankind. 1965 in freaking color. And let me mention you about that red stamp. Where is it? Okay, here it is. It's kind of rough. If you see, it's kind of worn out a little, but I still see that red stamp right there. I've seen different colors. I've seen blue ones, black ones, red ones. I don't know if there's green ones, but the red ones. And like I said before in my last videos, if you put in, and I don't even know if I can, I don't even know if I can see the stamp. I have to get a magnifying glass. But again, if you put this um, code number into um, Google, put NASA in that code number, this actual photo, whatever photo that's on this photo, is going to show up on Google because it has been cataloged by NASA. They have cataloged all their photos. It doesn't matter if it's type one, two, three, four, or whatever. It has been cataloged and it will show, even this photo, will sh the original photo of this before it got, you know, mistreated or whatever, thrown in someone's, you know, closet or garage, they'll show this photo what's when it was developed and it got cataloged into their archives but isn't that cool look at the side of that wow oh my gosh amazing all right everyone wow i don't know about you guys but i am super happy i'm gonna be posting these on instagram showing you the stills i might add some inserts as well if you haven't seen them already i hope you enjoyed that as much as me and maverick over here who's passed out you don't see him but maverick wants to say Goodbye to you all. Make sure, like I said, to subscribe to more World Cards. Please, please, please hit that bell button if you want to see more more World Cards. I'll be making more videos soon. Also, hit the like. And gosh, let's interact. Interact with me, guys. Let me know what you think about these type photo videos so I can do more. But I need comments because I have no clue what the what the is going on. So leave a comment. Leave a comment. That's all you got to do. This is Merlin for Moral Cards. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye for now.